Hello, my name is Jessica, and today I'm going to do sort of a grocery store haul for you. I just went grocery shopping to pick up a few items, and I found a few new items at the store that I have yet to try that I'm really excited about, so I thought I would do a quick video um, showing you some of my fun, new, interesting finds. Some of these items I have talked about before in videos or on Facebook, but there are some new items as well. In no particular order, I will go ahead and start. This is one item I have talked about a lot. This is almond milk. This is unsweetened pure almond silk milk. 35 calories per cup. It's amazing. I love this stuff. I mix it in with all of my Shakeology shakes. I use it instead of milk. It's much lower in calories and it actually has more calcium than regular milk. I guess we can stick with breakfast foods. I picked up today, I'm yet to try these, but I love waffles. Go the whole grain, low fat, waffles. For two of these, two of these is one serving, is only 140 calories. I think this will be a really quick, easy breakfast. You know, pop them in the toaster, get some spray butter out, spray a few squirts of that on, and you've got a really simple, really low in calorie filling breakfast food. This is Morning Star Farms Meal Starters. I have not tried these yet. I have seen a lot of people post about these on the internet. These are all made with all natural ingredients. And I guess you can more or less use this instead of ground beef in all different types of recipes. I'm not sure what the consistency or the texture is like compared to ground beef, but I can feel just in this bag that it's really, really fine. Obviously like ground beef would be if you ground it on the skillet. Two thirds of a cup is only 80 calories. So this would be great to add in really to any recipes you, you would use your ground beef with. So say spaghetti or lasagna or any other casseroles that you're trying to make a little healthier. These look great. I'm excited to try them. Another item I have not tried. Actually, I tried an, another version of these Boca Veggie Burgers over the weekend. I tried the mozzarella and mushroom burgers. They were really, really good. I was able to pick up both of these at my local Hy-Vee grocery store today for $5. Um, the two of them together for $5. So I thought it was a really good deal. There are four, it looks like, four soy protein burgers in each of these packages. One of them is flame grilled. It's the meatless burger. It's three Weight Watchers points, if you're counting your points, and each is 120 calories. And then I also picked up the original chicken meatless patties. I'm anxious to try these. I've never tried meatless chicken patties. So, I mean, I'm sure they're going to be great. I'm really anxious to try them. I think these are two are both great options that I can take to work and put in our freezer and then just literally microwave them for 45, 50 seconds, I believe, is all the longer they need to be to um, cook them since they are pre-cooked. So it's a really, really healthy Quick All right, the next item I picked up are House Foods Tofu Shirataki. I'm not sure if I am pronouncing that right. These are sp spaghetti noodles. They are in a bag of liquid. I found these in the tofu section of my grocery store, and there are only 40 calories per this entire bag for pasta. So that's really, really great if you are a heavy pasta eater like I am. So I could eat the entire bag for 40 calories. Pretty cool, huh? I first saw these featured on the Hungry Girl newsletter that I get daily, and I knew that I had to pick some of these up. Um, there's, cal or there's instructions on the back on how to prepare them. They are a bit different, obviously, than regular noodles, so you would need to read those. The back also says there's no cholesterol or sugar. Um, it's gluten-free, it's vegan, and obviously it's guilt-free, so I think this is a really neat option if you're a pasta lover. I'm really excited to try this in a recipe. Another item that I picked up is the Laughing Cow Cheeses. This is really great. These are the 50% less fat, light, garlic, and herb. There's only 35 calories per wedge, and you get eight wedges, spreadable wedges, per container. They're adorable. I don't know how you can't love these. And what I have been spreading them on are these hazelnut nut thins. One of my friends, my good friends, Nicole introduced these to me. I found these at my local Hy-Vee grocery store. I have actually already eaten an entire box of these because they are so good. You can eat 16 of these and they're only 130 calories. They're nut and rice crackers, wheat and gluten free, um, made my blue diamond. I think it's a really, really good choice, especially 
If you want to dip them in anything or, like I said, spread some low calorie cheese on them. All right, my last item. I'm very proud of myself for purchasing this. This is something that I would not typically try. I am a picky eater and I would usually probably be scared of something like this, but the more I read up about it and the more I looked into it, I'm actually really excited to try it. This is organic soy tempe. I'm not sure how you pronounce this. I found this in the tofu section of my grocery store. It is soy. It is made from the sunny islands of Indonesia, but the thing that I liked about it, I guess, obviously a lot of tofu is as well, but it's made of soybeans, water, and organic brown rice. I think that I would obviously like those ingredients, and it's really thick, so it's not like, like the smushy tofus. I think I'd have an issue with that texture and consistency. This is like a really firm little block of tempeh or whatever it is called. You can saute it, you can grate it, you can stew it or bake it. Um, you can use it for sandwiches and stir fries. So you more or less just kind of cut it up and you know cook it however you want. So I'm really excited to try this. I'll definitely post a picture of whatever it ends up looking like when I'm done cooking it. But I hope you enjoyed all of my my new groceries. I'm excited to share all of it with you. I hope this gave you you know a few ideas if you're needing just the extra push to eat healthy. If you, you know, if you're looking for quick snacks or quick meals, I hope that this gave you the extra motivation to go to the grocery store and pick out some healthy food. You will visit my site at beachbodycoach.com slash Jess Lambert, and that you'll connect with me on Facebook. On my like page, it is facebook.com slash Jess Beachbody. Thanks for watching.